Today we're going to set up a uh, scheduled task to reboot weekly. And to do that, we're going to hit start and we're going to type in schedule. And at the very top here, we see task scheduler. And off to the right, we want to say create basic task. And we're going to call it reboot weekly. Then we're going to hit next. And then we're going to check on weekly. Hit next. And we want to do it on Sunday. We want it to happen early in the morning. So 3 a.m works good. Um, I don't want it to reboot while I'm using the computer. So I want to hit next. And I'm going to start a program. And the program we're going to start is going to be um, a built-in program called Shutdown. And we want to say Browse. And this program lives under C, Windows, and System32. So that's what it looks like there. C, Windows, System32. And to quickly get to um, any file in a folder, you just type the letter of a folder that starts with. You can even type uh, the first two or three letters. So I'm going to type in SH. And that's going to get us down to the SH area. And we're going to scroll down a little bit more. And there's our program, Shutdown EXE. And we're going to open this. And we want to add two arguments. Uh, the argument that, that reboots the computer is, is dash R. And another argument is dash F. So dash F will force the computer to reboot. Um, and if there's any computer, any programs um, keeping it from rebooting, this will ignore those programs and it'll just force it to reboot. So if you wanted it to shut down, it would just be dash S. So we're just gonna do a reboot and we're gonna force it to reboot. We're gonna hit next, or we're gonna say reboot weekly. We wanna open this uh, properties dialog box here when we hit finish, and this is gonna allow us to add couple more elements to this to make sure it works. Uh, so when we hit finish, we want to make sure this can happen whether we're logged in or not. So we want to say run whether user is logged in or not. We're going to hit OK and then we're going to type in credentials. And they have to be admin credentials for this to work. And then I'm going to hit OK. And now you should see under our task scheduler library, we can now see this schedule here that says reboot weekly and if we right click on this we can test this and just right click and say run I'm not going to do that now because that would end my session very quickly here with you so that's a reboot weekly task scheduler and uh, I hope you enjoyed it thanks